Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back. It's Okimia back again with the blockchain hustlers here to discuss centralized versus decentralized. How important it is to the blockchain and how important it is to the cryptocurrency world. Like, <clears throat> there's a few people that are going to be in tune and be involved with this, but everyone is accepted. Know that, and it's not too late. It's never too late in investing yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, never. Look to the topic. Centralized versus decentralized. Centralized is a, a network that is governed by maybe a bank, any type of lender, any type of card holder. Decentralized is a network, however, that don't have to be operated with the decisions of someone higher up, such as a bank. You can't get the money from the bank if you don't have all the credentials that they need, right? So now that they're in the controlling state of what your necessities are now. So the point of decentralizing with this cryptocurrency atmosphere is to take out the middleman that has the government system to make these decisions and it doesn't benefit the peer-to-peer -peer transaction. So now with decentralized, I could take $250 and send it to a family member or a friend and I don't have to wait on our approval. I don't have to wait, sign any documents. I just show, choose the amount taken their, their IP, their wallet address and submit it and send those, send those funds just like cash out. But you, it's still centralized because you still have still have restrictions that you have to follow with Cash App, Venmo, all the any other Apple Pay, any other little other paid paid um, pay uh, apps or platforms you use, such as Square. You have to have a certain level of um, probably income income coming in, or maybe a charge fee a fee for for them collecting all of your information and finances i'm not i'm not really sure i don't use those such things i'm more going 80 percent bankless so like more so of my expenses will not be for a bank and only expenses i have to pay bills and everything like it's not to build anything saving anything or retaining anything. Only thing I retain from this, the central world is relationships. In case I do, you know, have a hundred acres somewhere, I need to go get a quarter million to finance this project, this minor project. Now, that's a centralized way. But being decentralized, there's no there's no peer to peer way of not being able to get what you need. 